Good afternoon everybody. My name is Christy Schwager. I'm the Education Coordinator at the Louis John Museum and Art Gallery. And today I thought I would, um, such a beautiful day to be outside, I thought it'd be great to, to uh, give you a little bit of a tour of um, the surroundings of where I work. I work in Crescent Park and this particular um, shot is of um, a location that's been here for a very long time. Um, our theme today is looking at some of the community projects that we've done in Crescent Park through our educational program. Um, and our first stop is um, talking about our ceramic murals. Our murals uh, that we do in Crescent Park are all hand cut tiles done by myself and um, many of the volunteers that have helped me with these projects. And the first project I want to point out to you is this one right here. And this is uh, our most recent one. This is looking at um, our most recent Canada 150. And during this um, year, uh, we decided to work with um, uh, the city of Moose Jaw, and we also are working, we worked with Grant McLaughlin on um, building this little sculpture and um, garden to um, celebrate Canada's 150. And in front of us you see that there is one, two, three, four, five, six leaves. Uh, this represents um, country symbol and if we get a little bit closer you can see that I've had a lot of help from school groups this particular leaf was created on Aboriginal day, day and looking at um, symbols of Aboriginal culture and things um, that was created on Aboriginal day as we look through this area, you see that um, uh, I've had some um, students that use words to represent what Canada means to them. Some are in English and in French. So I did have some help from the French community um, with some of the tiles. Um, All together, there were over 500 tiles created. So imagine, um, if you are hand making tiles, um, each one is hand cut. Students either carved into them or they um, colored them and glazed them. And, and on this side of the, um, the tiles, you see Canada 150 on here and other things that represent what Canada means to them. Um, so we've got the bottom is covered on this particular leaf and then if we look over here we have another one it says 1867 to 2017 which is the 150 and this particular leaf thanks all of the people that um, helped out with this project um, a lot of people as I mentioned there's over 500 and if we take a little bit of a closer look at this one, um, in some cases, when um, the tiles were fired and then glazed, I was able to kind of look at some of uh, the themes that were going on. And in this case, we have nature and things to do with animals in this one. So that's what I decided to do with this one. Okay, this is our final leaf, and this leaf uh, has a lot of text in it, but it also has some beautiful pictures of what Canada means to um, those particular individuals that were making them. So looking at it from this angle, you can see Main Street, and if we turn towards this direction, um, we have the Long Bridge and the Sanitol on the other side. So this is uh, one of the wonderful projects that we've created here 
uh, in Crescent Park to commemorate a special um, event that um, has gone in the past now. And um, I, I will um, carry on and we will look at another section of the park um, where we have done some work with tiles.